here I have a Firestorm drill. It's 18 volts. And I just have the drill. I don't have any batteries or anything with it. Now, I got a couple pieces of trap wire. One of the connectors are already on it. So I'm going to hook this one up to the, the positive side. Hopefully. And I'm going to hook this white one up I have to the negative side. And once I get these hooked in here, okay, look at that. So we're hooked on to the switch, and the way I figure out positive and negative, the run wire I just fell in that on the back of the switch. So then I hook the the run up to the run. The black wire, I just hook the white wire up to that. I always hook the red positive and the negative of any color I have. So, of course I pre-took the uh, cover off, and now I can put the cover back on. To bring the wires through. Like I said, I don't have a battery for it. I just found the drill. I always thought these drills were pretty adorable. Their main problem, I think, is the batteries in the charger. Chargers burn up the batteries. So I'll throw these screens in here real quick. I, I even think I lost one. Now with this 18 volt drill, we're going to run this up to 12 volts. Why? Because that's all we have in the power. We don't have an 18 volt battery. I just have a 12 volt battery that I scavenge out of a, a cable box. It's not a big lithium ion or a Nikon or anything, but we'll be able to repurpose this drill with that. Now I'm just gonna now I have the old speaker wire the uh the gold up to the rim that's close the match closest and the white to the silver yeah they match pretty good too I'll throw a little tape on those So I'm going to have to tape these wires up in that case, just so we don't pull them out. I'll wire this quickly and hook it up. I've done this before, but I really like to repurpose these drills. So you can still use them, I mean they're not cordless anymore. Because I have a cord, but they still are portable. And like I said, you can still use them. And what I'll do is I'll, I'll just tuck these wires in here. And I'll wrap some tape around this. I don't need to show you that, but something like this one. This is a Firestorm 9.6 drill that the battery went bad. And let me hook this up, just to show you how it can run. And then we'll put some connect connectors on these wires when we uh, to hook them up to the battery. Now look a little something like this, two connectors. But to get it running, we'll just hook them up. So we have an 18 volt Firestorm Pro. Hooked on a 12 volt battery. Now we can tell it's a little dyno power, but 
The snow works pretty darn good. Let's see if I can. Need to move that up a little bit. So let's try and draw in a hole with this. Works pretty good. Okay, there you have it. We hit we got our 18 volt power cord drill. Well that's why it smells really good when you drill that. Well we have our 18 volt power store drill. Like I said, I always thought these things were pretty normal, with the exception of the batteries and charger. So and and we get some decent torque out of it. So I'll go ahead and finish putting the screws in and take this up, but I just want to show you that an 18 volt drill, you can run it off a 12 volt battery and uh, still get some use on this drill, even, even if you do have a cord. We can still use this.